Meghan Markle only remained on the royal front line for as long as she had to before she could go after her desired life, a royal commentator has claimed in an express. Co.UK interview. Meghan and Harry now have a historic deal with Netflix. A contract with a high-profile public speaking agency and a lavish mansion in Santa Barbara where they live with their one-year-old son Archie. Royal commentator Howard Hodgson revealed his thoughts on Meghan's two-year stint as a working royal and claimed it may have been short for a reason. He said, she, was very determined, had been advancing her career, was a minor star before she met a royal prince, married a royal prince, stayed as long as is decent in the country she didn't want to be in doing jobs she didn't want to do. Then there was a short trip to Canada, which was only very short because it was then going to get her back to exactly where she wanted where she now is, and doing what she wants to do. Harry is just being dragged along and will probably, if he's not very careful, end up with the senselessly sad life that was that of the Duke of Windsor. The Duke of Windsor, formerly King Edward VIII, triggered a constitutional crisis in 1936 when he abdicated in order to marry his twice-divorced partner, Wallace Simpson. He was effectively sent into exile for the rest of his life in France, and no members of the royal family attended his wedding. Mr. Hodgson is not the only commentator to have claimed Meghan appeared to jump ship very quickly. Journalist David Jones interviewed some of her royal friends and acquaintances and claimed that none of them were surprised this free spirited and untamable, headstrong woman has so prematurely jumped the royal ship. While Harry has indicated that he was unhappy being a royal in the past, these friends feel sure Meghan will have been the prime instigator of their hasty escape. One of her oldest confidants allegedly said, with Meghan, it has always been her way or the highway. She is always the center of the relationship, regardless of Harry's title. She wants to be in the limelight, but under her own terms. Now she will get to make her own rules. It's perfect for her. Meghan likes to flee when things get heavy, and observe from afar what she has done. Speaking to the Daily Mail, they added, she is running a campaign. This is not just an exit. It is a long game strategy that has been set in motion for some time.